is a really exciting stage for me to be at now. Um, come down to visit the boat, Jamie and Emily at Global Boatworks in Cornwall. And this is, this is my beast, right here. I think he's going to be called Gulliver. Um, he's going to get me safely across the oceans. What a pretty wee boat. He is a pretty boat. <laughs> so how many hours have gone into this, Jamie? Just the hull here, probably about 220, five weeks, six weeks. Blood, sweat and tears. Yeah. They're all built one off over frames rather than out of the mould. Having built traditional boats, I kind of fuse modern um, materials with traditional know-how. For instance, using keelsons and then stems and aprons. That's how we can form a much finer boat. Hey. Hopefully we make it more slick through the water. North Pacific 2012, North Atlantic 2013. They're going to be epic. I think the most challenging parts of the whole journey really. And so I need to know that I've got the best boat possible. There is no better boat, I don't think. It's constructed with really hard foam in the middle. Kevlar, <laughs> bulletproof. And then two layers of glass, either side, glass fiber. It's only, what, that thick? But bomb proof, absolutely bomb proof. So the idea being, even if I crash into something, then hopefully there'll be no problems. You're invisible at sea, really. You're so tiny, you're so vulnerable in many ways. But I think being in a boat like this makes you feel like you're, you're in a, a safe little capsule, which you are, you're sort of protected. So in here we have the cabin. <laughs> It's all en suite. That's where I'm going to have my four poster bed in there. Solar panels will go on the top here. The boat will get steered from this bit just here. There'll be a rudder, a big fat rudder on the back there. And here we've got the forward cabin where everything else gets stored. So lots of space in there for six, seven months at sea maybe on the Pacific. A very beautiful beast. Gulliver. My man, my man for the ocean.